The coast-to-coast -coast forecast shows quite the mess unfolding across the nation. Wet weather stretches from Maine all the way down through New Mexico. Severe storms, blizzard conditions, heavy and steady rain, it's all a part of the situation. Locations south of the Great Lakes stretching down towards Texas have been dealing with an abundance of moisture and there are significant flooding concerns for those areas. The cooler air wraps in behind this system and it generates heavy snow across portions of New Mexico and into the western portion of Texas where blizzard conditions are likely. As this area of low pressure lifts northward through the day on Sunday, the cold front associated with that system sweeps all the way down to the Gulf of Mexico. Severe storms are possible along that frontal boundary and that a chance for a strong thunderstorm activity will shift eastward into the Ohio River Valley as we head through the day on Monday. Further north, that precipitation all comes in the form of snow, and there may be quite a bit of it for locations across the upper Midwest will finally clear out and dry out early next week across the southern plains. Then this messy weather moves toward the northeast as we head toward Tuesday in the form of rain and snow. Uh, the rainfall totals will be impressive, especially in areas uh, across southern Missouri, down through Arkansas. Many of these locations have already picked up two to four inches, and rainfall totals, by the time it's all said and done, will likely range between four to six inches for those red and orange shaded areas. Temperatures across the nation today vary greatly, much warmer in locations to the east, 60s and 70s for places like New York and D.C., while it's considerably cooler toward the west, but there's more sunshine. High temperatures in the teens and upper 20s from Minneapolis down through Denver.